Oh, here we go. We're about to summon the third. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. He's got 82,000 health. All right, he nearly killed me. I died to Garameth. Soul Stone Survivors, guys. So if you've seen Vampire Survivors before, this is pretty much a, no, I wouldn't say a remake, but obviously like a version of it. It's, it takes the same premise as Vampire Survivors, except it's in 3D and it's made in Unity Engine, which I know a little bit about. I used to develop indie projects in Unity Engine. So anyhow, it's just dropped on Steam. It's like 15 bucks. And um, yeah, we're going to get stuck into it. So by the looks of it, there's characters. They have different effects, different abilities and things. Um, I'm quite new to this. I've played 20 minutes. Okay, so we're going to Crack open a drink. Ah. Oh, no. So spaces to dash. All right, nice. So it looks like we have some objectives at the top there too. Eliminate the Lords of the Void and eliminate monsters. Okay, so you can pick between three abilities. This gets pretty spammy later on. You end up just having to just level up, level up, level up and grab abilities. Give me those little yellow nom noms. I feel like Pac-Man. Die, orcs, die. There's something so satisfying about watching their little health bars just deplete. <laughs> It looks like all my abilities are on a time limit, as you can see. So I could see myself just like whacking this game on, putting on some music on Spotify and just relaxing, just jamming out to it. If I don't get lifesteal, I'm dead. Eliminate Alexi the Plague Bearer. Okay, boss time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, it's a big boy. See you later, Pudge. Eliminate monsters to summon the Lord. There's just so many abilities. <laughs> I can't. There's just too many. I'm a god. I'm a freaking god. I don't want any more abilities. Leave me alone. I just want to summon the lord. There we go. We're so close. We're so close. We're so close. 48, 49, 50. Okay, so this must be the boss boss. Oh, real place choices with pa- Oh, with passives. So I can keep my abilities and I can just have passives now. Fantastic. Oh, he's getting destroyed. We are too OP for this guy. No, he doesn't stand a chance. You goddamn spy kids looking mother- I got you outnumbered. My ninja kunais. He's dead. We got him. What is happening? There's more menus than anything. This game's turned into a menu simulator. Oh, I keep going. I'm on 8 HP. I'm on 8 HP. No, 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 no. I died. Well, we have enough to buy this dude. So let's try the mage out, shall we? Oh, I love how it just burns through them all. Burn, yes. Give me all the pack name num nums. Oh, arcane disc. Oh, that's cool. Look, mom, I'm playing World of Warcraft. The avatar of fire, he's back. He's back with a vengeance. But this time it's fire against fire. No, you don't. No. Oh, I'm squishy. The major squishy. This game's stressful. Oh, I killed him. No. Oh, no. I died. Well, guys, that's a quick look at Soulstone Survivors. That's all I have for you today. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe. Make sure to share it around. I know everybody hates hearing that on YouTube these days. But I'm looking at exploring a lot of indie games at the moment. I am a first-person shooter guy, and I'm really having fun time looking through some indie games. So if you guys want to see more variety content, make sure to let me know, and stay deadly.